Welcome to Module 4 Part Drawing. This is Unit 1. We are going to present the first interface of a draft. We click on Isometric Draft and Solid Edge has one sheet. Icon View you can activate background sheets that Solid Edge gives you. The working sheet you have will be A2 size with the corresponding background. See, we can't change the title block on the working sheet. It is on the background sheet where we can, for example, delete some part of the title block. And now our working sheet has the new title block. Now I need to insert a new working sheet and I'm going to change the size because now I want, for example, to be A4 tall with the corresponding background A4. I check it is A4 tall, so I change it and background. And now you will see what happens. The problem is Solid Edge hasn't A4 tall background sheet. So we are going to insert a new background sheet and state I need A4 tall size. Now is A4 and I change the name. This is quite useful so you have a different name for each sheet. I change the name, I accept and in the working sheet I will change the background to have the same size for working and background. See, I don't have any title block. First, I'm going to rename my new working sheet. For example, it's for part one. And I'm going to customize a title block on the background sheet. For example, I just state a new name so you can have different working sheets with different backgrounds. But background sheet and working sheet should have the same size. I go to my part and I will have the background corresponding. This is what you will have available. We have created this file with one sheet A2 with the corresponding title block we have drawn for you and for assemblies also. But for example, you might need to have a different sheet. I want to insert an A3 tall. You can need it for a new draft. I change to A3 tall and I give it a name. For example, my background. I go back to my working sheet, but I want to have a title block. I don't need it to draw it from scratch. I can copy this title block I already have, you will have it available, and I can paste it in my empty background. I paste it 
Of course, it is too big because it was in my A2 size. But I just can scale it until it has the size that fits in your background. And you can change your icon. You can change, of course, the name, the date, etc. It is still too big. So I'm going to scale it a bit more until I think it fits with my background. So I needn't to draw all the title block from scratch. Now, for example, now I can insert a new working sheet knowing that I have the corresponding background. The size is going to be 8 feet tall. I have just my background sheet done. And it's my background. And see, you have your title block. Now I can change the name. This is the end of module 4, unit 1. In unit 2, we will create drawing views.